Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Jam and I am coming back at you with a fab wig review. These are definitely some love finds and I cannot wait to get started. But before I do, as always, I like to thank you to all my new subscribers who take the time to hit the button to subscribe because you hit the button and you don't have to, you choose to. So thank you. And to all my old ones, thanks for hanging in there. And let me go ahead and get started. I did record this particular video about a week ago, but after I watched them, I really didn't like them. So I'm re-recording, so I'm hoping this comes out better. So, first wig I'm going to review is definitely a lo-fi. It is a shortcut wig um, from the Red Carpet series. Um, and you see I have stacks of wigs back here because... In my absence, I've had purchased plenty of wigs, so and I do want to review them all. But these are new purchases. So um, let's get started. So the first one I'm going to try uh, again is Red Carpet Premiere. This is the unit here, and I have her in the color uh, SH1B teal. She is a mohawk uh, style wig. Very cute. I love sh nice shortcut wigs. I like the fact the hair is really not coming to uh, coming in your face as much. So, and as you know, I don't want to make this a long-winded review. It really doesn't have to be. Actually, I will make this a double wig review. So this is one of two with two wigs I'm going to review. Okay, one of two I'm going to review. So let's try this one on. I have it here. So this is the unit. Um, did it have any combs? Unit, full, complete wig. Absolutely no combs in this unit. I would say it's a uh, big diva head friendly. I love the back of this unit. Look at those curls. I mean, they are laid. They are laid. You see that? in the front um, some mohawk style that comes into the back curls here and the boy cut side short and I love the back how it's tapered right here so let's try this on Okay, get it adjusted. And this wig you can play with some. Bring some of those hairs out behind the ear. Bring some of those out. And this is pretty much it for this unit here. This is an absolute love find. I love this wig. It's absolutely bomb. I mean, wigs have come such a long way. Oh my goodness. I mean, they're just... I mean, I can't talk. Because, you know, back in the day when I first started wearing wigs... I used to have the wiggy looking wigs, but I ain't know no better. Got a little older, got a little more hipper. I wouldn't dare buy a wiggy wig now. I don't have some wig fails. Definitely some wig fails, but you know, I try not to have too many of those anymore. So other than that, if you like this wig, um, I purchased this from samsbeauty.com. So Yes, definitely check them out if you like this unit. I believe this unit actually went on sale after I purchased it. So, um, I don't think they have any more of the popular colors such as teal and purple or the uh, blue anymore. You have to check them out to see. But, uh, this is in teal. I got bitten by the color bug and I'm pretty much enjoying it. So, let me turn around and give y'all some views of this unit here. So this is the side view of the unit. 
Uh, turn around. My space is kind of tight here. Back of the unit. And then I'm going to show you the other side of the unit. Oof. Do I look pregnant? Oh my God. It's just fat. Okay. And that's the other side of the unit. That's pretty much it. Um for this particular wig here so if you like short wigs this is definitely a wig for you um nothing in your face except these little uh flare hair flare hairs or i don't know what you want to call it, sideburns um but other than that it's just it's an awesome wig um definitely great for me as y'all know i like to say living in florida we need i need short units they can always be long and flurry and full although i like all that stuff but it's always good to have a good short wig so the next wig i am going to review for you guys being that this is going to be a double wig review uh this was also a samsbeauty.com uh, purchase but this one is an oldie but goodie um, this is a very popular wig and I, I remember when this wig came out because I saw a lot of posts um, in hair groups that I'm in, wig groups rather, that I was in. And it's Charlie. And I ordered Charlie in the UNDK purple. Now I will admit when I first got Charlie she was not a love find for me. Um, I didn't really like the texture of Charlie's hair um, it's almost like a silky with a mixture of kind of like yakky and I guess the first time I tried this particular unit on um, I guess I didn't I was trying to wear it pull back like this because the hair was in my face um, but it's actually not a bad unit so um, I won't give it an absolute love find like this unit here. And by the way, the name of this unit um, was Kim Mohawk, which I didn't say before. But it's Kim Mohawk in teal. And of course, she comes in blue back, gold, and a 1B30. So let me take this one off, and we're going to get into the review of Charlie. And I know Charlie has uh, multiple reviews already on here, so... We're going to go ahead. I'm going to still just do my little review on it. So, but give y'all one more good look of Kim the Mohawk here. Because, ma'am, Kim, ma'am, I don't. I'm recording this late. Maybe I get, you know, you know, don't judge me. It's pretty late. I only had one drink. <laughs> but, um, this uh, wig right here is just pure life for me. I, I love it. So, let me go ahead and get this one off and put her back in her packaging. And I'm for certain weeks of mine after I finish wearing them, I do put them back in their packaging, put the net back over them. Now I gotta figure out what wigs I'm gonna give away now that I have purchased these two, and there's another unit that I want to purchase. Um, I can't think of the name right offhand, but it's not a new wig. Uh, oh, yes, it is. It's the Ari wig. That one's on my list. The Ari 24. Oh, my gosh. I've been watching some reviews for that one. Um, and that's actually like a second rendition of the wig because the wig had already came out, but in a shorter version um but now they have it in a longer version which is everything oh my god it is so pretty that's what i love about wigs now i mean it just looks like you done paid bundles on bundles and you wear wigs i mean in one particular group i'm in one young the owner of the group wigs be so slayed to where you know the people that sell hair from china they take her pictures um, saying that 
it's Indian, Malaysian, a body wave, and she be wearing wigs. I like, oof. But yes. So this is how I preserve my wigs. I pretty much keep them in their packaging. Okay, so here's Charlie. You see one review on Charlie, you see them all. This one is just mine. So uh Charlie again it's a full cat wig, no combs. And again, at first I didn't wasn't too crazy about the texture of Charlie, but let me just throw it on so y'all guys can see. And Charlie has this little poof up here that I'm really not a fan of on the wig itself. I mean, the style of the wig is not a bad style. It's a really cute style wig. Um, again, short side, which I love. Uh, but yeah, but Charlie like this, I like it. But when I first got this wig, I was trying to wear it like this, and I'm going to show you. I was trying to wear it like pull back like this and it's I mean I I guess you could wear it like this but it's not intended to be worn like this I mean you make any wig your own but the card even on the card you know it, it gives you you know it shows you how the um, model is wearing a wig which is pretty much the best way to wear this particular unit is to have it pulled down to me let me get that clear <laughs> or make that clear I should say but this is Charlie and again I got her in the purple and she's cute Charlie got the girl on me um, I like it it's a good unit to have for the summer not too much a big fan of hair in my face per se but it's not too bad and it always can be swooped like that um but i think it looks better when it's actually worn a little bit more in the face but other than that that's pretty much it um this other wig over here i think i already did a review on that did I load it? I, that is the question. <laughs> but um, I was just trying to check to see was there another wig review I need to do. There is, but I need to find a card for the wig. Um, I actually got the wig there. But since I'm already doing two review, two wigs in this video here, and I'm already at 13 and a half minutes, I don't want to do another wig review. So... Till next time, all my links will be below. Thumbs up this video if this review was helpful for you in making your decision on Charlie or Kim Mohawk. Again, um, Charlie was a Freetress, uh, Eagle Freetress wig, and Kim Mohawk was a Premier Red Carpet. Both units purchased at samspeedy.com, uh, purchased with my own pesos. Um, and that's pretty much it. You can catch me on Snapchat. Um, chocolate Let's Beyond. I think that's my... I think that's it. I don't think I have any numbers. Chocolate Let's Beyond. Oh, I feel like I'm getting old. And I, and I was just on Snapchat. And you know what I was looking for? I'm embarrassed to say. But I was looking for this phone that I'm recording off of right now. Okay, well, that means it's really time for me to stop this video. I'm going crazy now. But um, till next time, again, thank you to all my subscribers who have been hanging in there, who continue to watch my videos and leave uh, messages, um, I mean, leave comments rather, and to all my new subscribers. Um, thanks for watching. And till next time, you guys. Do you like still make me happy? 
looking for my stylist because you know it ain't no fancy outro here. Mm.